Hi guys, this is Otto from Tom.com and today I want to show you how you can add an additional keyless to RTS to a roller shutter motor, in this case the Oxymo RTS which is in the shutter behind me and I have this keyless already linked as you can see and the only tool you're going to need is a small screwdriver. So the first thing I'm going to do is put the motor in programmer mode and to do that I'm going to use the original keyless 2. I'm going to start by turning it over and you can see a small opening in the top section of this clip. I'm going to put the screwdriver in. I'm going to gently push this clip up until it comes off. Now you see two openings and in one opening there are two strips. I'm going to connect these two strips with the top of my screwdriver so that the LED on the front starts flashing. And as you can see it's flashing now. So what I'm going to do is press the button until the motor responds. And now it's in programming mode, which means I can add the new transmitter. I'm going to do the same thing, turn it over, push up the clip, connect the two strips until the light starts flashing, as you can see here. I'm going to press the button as well, so that now this button also controls the roller shutter. I'm going to test it to see if it works, and yes, it's working. So I now have two transmitters that I can use. So you, if you have two cars, you can put it in either car or put it in a keychain. So we're all good. If you have any questions about this procedure, how to add key to this remote controls or any other remote control to some RTS motor, do let me know. You can send an email to info at tom.com or you can leave a comment below the video. In any case, thank you for watching. See you next time.